Hello everyone, this is Anpam from anpampasan.com and in this video I will be reviewing a AI art generator called artsmart.ai. With this tool you can generate blog images, social media images with the power of AI. They also have 50 free AI image generations so you can test out the software before buying. Also this is going to be my first look at this software. So let's begin, let's check out their website and then I'll take you to the dashboard and we'll see how it looks like. So yeah, first look at their website, it looks really good. And as you can see, there is community text to image artwork that people have made. So they showed, uh, it's like a showcase for them. Uh, this looks really hyper realistic and uh, you can explore the community side of it. And uh, these are all the images that uh, people have generated using this uh, tool, AI, Art Smart AI. As you can see, they look really, really good. The images look really good. It looks hyper realistic. So if you go over here, you can check out the roadmap, documents, uh, pricing. You can explore, like we are here on Explore page. Uh, there is what's new. So whatever updates they have done, uh, which will be available over here. And uh, there is contact us and API. API is also there so you can integrate it inside your app and uh, affiliate program privacy policy. So this is their roadmap. As you can see, if you have a feature update for them or if you have a new idea you want to submit to them, you can submit it on their roadmap. And uh, here there are so many uh, people who have uh, submitted their ideas and some of them are in open status or some of them are in progress. There are some in beta, like hyper-realistic mode, which is like a create a mode trained to produce images like photography. Uh, it's a hyper-realistic mode and I'll show you what it is. It's in beta and it's available for us as well. And um, yeah, there's outpainting, which is going to come soon. It's in progress at the moment. And uh, logo generation is there, so you can like generate a logo for your business. You can do that, uh, and uh, it's going to come, I guess, come soon. It's an open uh, save settings, light face recognition, fix hands. The AI model has an issue with the producing hands at the moment. We are researching ways to resolve this. Okay, okay. So yeah, these are like uh, different things they are working on. There is social share, post to Instagram is also coming. And uh, ability to save, select custom prompts and negative prompts is there. Maybe a drop down menu or a tag word to use certain group of words with the prompt. Upscale images in bulk is there. So you can upscale uh, your images in bulk. And uh, there is uh, ability to create full length portrait. You can do that. Then social share post to Facebook is also coming soon. And then there is tune storage. So longer than 30 days. So tunes are something like um, AI avatar creator. So you can upload your image like my image. And then I can convert it into an AI looking image. Like you must have seen on internet of all these celebrities having their AI image of themselves. You can do it with this software, but uh, this tool, but it will cost you. Like it's a, uh, it's not available with their plans. Like it's, it's going to be a separate add-on. So yeah, that's the case with them, and it costs like fourteen dollars per uh, uh per tune, and uh, this is how it is, and. Social share, post to Reddit is also coming soon. Add what mar what marks to a creation is also coming soon. And uh, rework for face enhancers there. All these things you can check out on their roadmap. Let's go over to their frequently asked questions. So these are some of the frequently asked questions they have uh, on their website. So some of the questions like how does stable diffusion compare to DAL E and uh, known model issues and all the different things. Do credits roll over? Your credits refresh at the beginning of every month. Unfortunately, they don't roll over. Access to future updates is there. And uh, okay, so let's move off from the frequently asked questions. Let's go to their pricing. I was checking out their pricing and that's how I found out about tunes. 
And uh, tunes, like I said before, tunes is like a AI art uh, for generator for your avatars, like your image, like my own myself. Like if I put my own image there, it will create an AI looking image for it. Just like all the celebrities, there are so many celebrities that have their own AI image for themselves. You can do that in this and uh, tunes, create AI uh, avatars from your images and one tune, uh, fine tuned model, uh, eight prompts is there, 64 AI avatars is there. So eight prompts uh, from this and then eight images per prompt. So downloadable AI model file is also there. I don't know what this is here. 104 more AI avatars. So like if you do this and then you can like make another add-on, like purchase another add-on for 104 more AI avatars. So like here in the first uh, tunes plan, we have uh, 64 AI avatars. If you give seven more dollars, then you can get like 104 AI more avatars and 13 more prompts. So yeah, this is how it is. And then there is pay as you go plan. So if you don't want to pay monthly, you can do that. One time payment and all, you can do that. Then there is the plans. So here we have the basic plan, which is the starting one, which is uh, for $19 per month, which is, they all have like a 30 day, 30 day money back guarantee. And uh, for the starting one, it is saying like you can get thousand image generations all ai tools is there they are like i think there are like six tools inside i'll show you in the when we get to the dashboard uh all post processing tools and save presets prompt image search camera shot angle okay so the next plan is uh they're just increasing the limits here for standard it's 29 dollars per month which is going to give you like uh, 2500 image generations and for business it's uh, 6000 image generations so yeah, that's uh, how it is. Nothing is getting changed in these plans. It's just, okay, there's one change in standard and business. You are getting an API access. If you want, if you would like to uh, get the API access to, to integrate a, a art smart AI into your app, you can do that with the API. So you need the standard and business plan for that. And uh, okay, so yeah, so you have more features, uh, create your own AI generated avatars. Okay, so yeah, this is for tunes. When we click here, it goes to tunes. So this is how it is. So let's look at their change log first. Then we will go over to the dashboard and look all the tools they have inside it. So this is their change log and uh, they have come out with uh, some updates recently, like the hyper realistic mode, which is inside. And uh, it is a big update. And yeah, it's like generating really good uh, hyper realistic images like mid journey. If you know uh, chat GPT, it has a mid journey from OpenAI. So it's looking really great. And uh, here, as you can see the image of the person here, uh, these are looking very hyper realistic. So it looks good. So they're showing you how you can get to that. And these are the tools they have. You can get ArtSmart AI on AppSumo, which is uh, currently available on AppSumo. It just got released on AppSumo, uh, actually. But at the time of making this video, it got released like one week ago, I think. And uh, AppSumo is like a leading marketplace for lifetime deals of softwares. And um, here, as you can see, that uh, it is available for just $39 at the starting price. And it's one code, $39. And you also get like 60 day money back guarantee compared to 30 day money back guarantee, which was on our smart AI pricing page. Also, they're not giving it for lifetime. It's like it's monthly plan. And uh, here you're getting like for $39, you're getting it for lifetime. And uh, it's a 60 day money back guarantee as well. So if you don't like it, if you don't like this software, you can get a full refund within two months. So make sure to redeem it. And they got uh, featured uh, by AppSumo. So you can see that uh, the YouTube video for them. And uh, these are this is like images for how it works and stuff. And uh, you can see here. Then we have uh, plans and features. So lifetime access to artsmart.ai. All future basic plan updates are there. And basic plan updates. So let's look at their pricing and check what the basic plan was okay so this one 
uh, $19 per month plan. So they're giving like the basic plan updates, but I think it's just the limits. Like, okay, there is no API access inside it, I think. Uh-huh. They seem to not give API access with the um, lifetime deal. So they are only giving like the basic plan, which is uh, does not have the API access, and uh, it's going to be the limits on the image generations, which is going to increase if you take more codes. That's what's going to happen. And here we have uh, all future basic plan updates, like I said before, and all future all must uh, you must redeem your code within sixty days of purchase. Stack up to four codes. You can stack up to four codes. And uh, for the tunes, the custom avatar, avatar AI, you can get an exclusive. It's like an they have an exclusive add-on for that. Uh, fifty percent additional custom avatar tune credits during the campaign. Okay, so maybe they're going to give you some way to get uh, like to be able to purchase it, and it's going to be fifty percent less, something like that. And uh, future updates. Feature, feature updates in all plans. Uh, generate images with AI, edit images with the AI, and uh, schedule and auto share with the social media planner. So they also have a social media planner inside it. And um, single plan is uh, $39, which is good. Uh, you get 750 credits per month, all features above included. Uh, some images are going to are going to consume uh, more credits like three or four credits so that can happen depending on I guess depending on the settings that you choose and uh, for the double plan is $78 which is um, all features above included increase in the limits of credits it's going to be 1500 so double of that and then multiple is 3000 and you get one custom avatar model. So this thing, one customer, uh, one custom avatar models, tunes feature is available for one, for multiple plan, and it's only one. Like you're, it's not going to keep repeating per month. You're just going to get once. Uh, so that's something which people are complaining about, like why uh, we don't get it per month. Once you used up the uh, custom avatar model thing, you have to purchase it again. And with four codes, you're going to get two custom avatar uh, tunes thing. And you have 5,000 credits per month for this uh, $156. Uh, and so here we have uh, the post they have done and by the founder, Josh, Surfwatch. I guess they have another tool on AppSumo, Surfwatch. That's why it's like this. Custom AI avatar tune info. So tunes are held for 30 days, then deleted. Uh, each tune gets 64 images. Extra tune images can be purchased for Sumo links at 40, yeah, 50 percent price. So they're going to give a 50 percent discount if you are Sumo link, but you still have to purchase it. So it's not like you can get it per month for the tunes. So that's the thing, and uh, this is due to lim uh, technical limitations. I guess it uh, takes up a lot of their server space, uh, server resources uh, to you make these tunes. That's why it's uh, so limited, and. Uh, yeah, they do the credits include hyper-realistic and outpainting in the future? And they say, yes, uh, they are going to do it. Yeah, these are the like questions. They are very active on AppSumo, which is uh, really good. And do I need to buy tunes separately? Uh, if you buy the upper tiers, three or four, then you get the access to the tunes, but it's not going to renew. So it's like um, if someone buys it for four codes, you're just going to get it two times. Like 16 reviews are there so far, and uh, the people are seem to be liking this sort of, uh, tool a lot. As you can see, uh, every every review is like five tacos, so it's good. People are liking it, and um, some of them are giving it four tacos, but it's just because they probably don't like something and they just want to have that feature. That's why they're like putting it four tacos, so that once that feature is included, they can just put it on five. So yeah. And uh, let's go over to their dashboard next. So we are on the dashboard now and uh, let's look at some of their apps they have currently available. So uh, as you can see, I'm on the like uh, free plan currently. I just wanted to test it out. And uh, they have uh, 
50 free credits for me at the moment because I'm on the free plan and uh, I can buy more credits if I want to from here. Uh, they have an hyper realistic, uh, it's in beta, so you can create hyper realistic uh, AI images like build an artistic style categorized by high re realistic graphic representations. Uh, you can do outpainting. I thought that outpainting means that I can like uh, remove the image, like a, a person or an object from an image, but it seems outpainting is like if you have an image, you can like extend it further. So with the help of AI, so you can do that. And um, we have share on social media. So they have like a, a scheduler inside which you can uh, like schedule your posts on social media. So you can do that over here. Uh, there's only a Twitter integration, I guess, so far. Yeah, there are only a, a Twitter integration. So you can like schedule your AI images uh, to Twitter. Okay, so now there is tunes. So tu tunes, I can't uh, access it because I did not like this uh, whole idea of like you need to like get, you just get one or two tunes for that hype hype plan and it's not something which I'm really interested in but I will show you on um, YouTube uh, for this uh, this is a video they have and uh, it seems like you can upload your image over here it will like say okay which image you want to uh, choose and you can like generate more output so you give it a prompt. And it's going to give you all these like uh, realistic images of your avatar that you, uh, your image that you put uh, this way. Looks really good, but uh, what's the point if uh, we are going to just get like one or two tunes? But uh, the pricing is not that bad. Like uh, for fourteen dollars, you can generate one like tune for yourself. So that's good. For a lifetime deal, that's what I'm saying. Like it's not that good in that in that case. And let's go over to the playground. Let's generate some of the AI images and let's check how it works and hyper realistic mode as well. So first, let's go over to the playground, generate an AI image. And here you can see there's a guide. There's mode. There's presets. You can add a preset, digital, cyberpunk, cartoon, arc with animal photography photography auto photograph uh building i guess let's select digital so it gave us a prompt for this digital preset and uh let's see my images we don't have any images yet image lookup is there so you can like select an image from external source and then there's camera angles so deep focus rack focus shallow focus soft focus all these things are there then there's aerial shots so if you would like the uh, it this helps uh, art smart to visualize the specific location where the camera is placed to take that shot so you can do that like if you want an aerial uh, shot ai image that is generated you can do that let's uh, choose it to see how it works and um Image to image, uh, upload an image to give uh, an idea of what you want to create. Okay, so maybe let's not uh, upload it over here. Let's see what it does. And uh, for the image uh, within the, um, height, let's uh, keep it at 512, 512. Show advanced uh, guidance scale, number interference steps. Let's keep it that way negative uh, prompts are there so that people don't generate something weird okay and then there's seed okay let's hide the advanced uh, options and let's uh, see how it works uh, how it uh, what it gives us and let's generate it it will take one credit so it's processing right now and let's see what it comes up with what are we waiting for okay so as you can see, it generated a really good looking image for us. Like, um, I did not give it any, like what it, there needs to be inside this, but uh, just by aerial shot and that, it gave us a really good image. In painting is uh, going to be something which you can use to uh, 
draw over something uh, on the image and you can remove it. You can fix some things in the image and stuff. You can remove the objects from it. And uh, it has an inbuilt uh, feature here. So you can uh, choose it. You can choose the like uh, brush size and then there is an inpainting prompt that you can put. So after that, it will take up one credit and then it will uh, remove that object from that image. So here uh, we removed the uh, certain objects inside this image that we generated using in painting. So as you can see over here on this uh, rock, I removed that part. And then here there was a small uh, object that I removed, which was inside the water. And here we have face in hands. So if you have an image that you generated, which is of a person face and it is distorted, then you can use this uh, AI feature inside this uh, face in hands. And this way it will like uh, correct the AI uh, facial distortion. Uh, it will also take up one credit. They have these three AI feature tools inside this. And the third one is upscale. If you would like to upscale the image, you can do that. If you want to upscale it, it can be done to three, I guess. And uh, if you do three upscale, it will be... Okay, there is two upscale and three upscale. So if you want to do it for three, it will take up two credits. And if you do it for two, it will take up one credit. And uh, these are all the features inside this uh, tool. And uh, you can crop, flip, add a text inside this image. You can zoom it. And there's a new canvas. If you don't want this, you want to start a new canvas, you can do that. You can load image from the computer and uh, work on that with the AI. Uh, you can download the image of this. Also, there uh, on this side, there's camera angles, like I said before. There's short, short focus and uh, short angles that we selected. Uh, with this camera focus, you can like select this way, like uh, this is the person standing. And then you can like select how far uh, do you want the art smart to look for. Uh, if we select this, it will be medium shot. If we select this, it will be full shot this way. Uh, the framing of your image. Uh, it help, this helps the art smart to decide the framing of your image. Okay, so it seems that the hyper realistic mode is currently on maintenance mode and it will not be available for 48 hours. So I won't be able to show it over here. And uh, let's go over to the AI art that I generated for a uh, duck wearing a hat with glasses. And I could not show you in the playground because I backed off from there. So to go over to your generated image, you can uh, go to your this icon on the top right and uh, go to my profile. And here you will see that uh, there's images that you have generated. So you can check over here. There's presets. Uh, this is not that I generated. I don't know what this is. And then there's uh, tunes. So you can buy the tunes for $14. Um, because I'm on the free plan, I don't have any tunes credit. And for the image, this is it. Let's check it out. Uh, it is public. I can make it private if I want to. With, with public, it will show up on the Explore page on the main website. And credits used is 12 because I did use a bit of the credits. Uh, I kept repeating uh, the generation. That's why it kept using the credits. Image is one credit only. Uh, like I said before, that it takes up three or five credits, but that's not the case. It will only take up one credit, but if you do certain AI features, uh, th those will add up. So the one image will count up to like four or five credits as well. So these are all the like uh, image prompts that I used. And uh, this is the one thing that I typed. Guy wearing duck hat on bike. There is no bike here. Like uh, these are the images. Like there's no bike in this, but uh, it did generate some semi-realistic looking images. Looks really good. As you can see, there's a duck, which looks like a 3D model. And um, although it's not a human, like a guy wearing duck hat, it just it's just a duck. And uh, this one uh, is like a sky fi version of uh, like a Chinese uh, guy with a hat. 
Okay, they've kind of made it look like a duck. And here, this one looks good, but it I, I prefer if it would have been like a front-facing image. Uh, it seems like this thing over here is a bike. And this guy is going over to the bike. And this one just uh, straight up looks like a dragon, like a duck dragon. And uh, it's like reaching to the water. And this looks like a mask that he's wearing. So it looks like a sky fi looking picture over here. You can copy the prompt from here if you would like to make a similar looking image. You can do that uh, with the prompt. You can copy the people's prompt from the explore page. And here you can see that I've used the 12 credits. So this was the my profile page and then there is settings. If you go here, there's a way to put uh, the app sumo uh, code. Uh, you can do it over here, uh, tier one. You can like uh, insert the app sumo code and you can redeem it. So it goes all the way up to tier four with the uh, two, two tunes, which is only available for once. So once you used the two tunes, uh, that's it. You will have to buy the tunes again. Uh, it, it is not per month for the app sumo code and so this is what it is and then yeah that's all there is to it for artsmart.ai and uh, I could not show the hyper realistic mode because of the maintenance and it's just going to like uh, generate an AI image which is very hyper realistic and there's outpainting which i said before that you can like um, put a image and it will complete the image for you like uh, extend the borders out uh, with the help of ai and maybe if i can go to the explore page i can show you some of the hyper realistic ones okay so this one uh, is hyper realistic so you can see it does look hyper realistic but it, at the same time it kind of looks like little bit of a cartoon uh, although looks good and I think this one is also hyper okay this is semi realistic this may no yeah this one is hyper realistic it does look really good this image looks really good and uh, these are like images that they have uh, generated the face looks distorted yeah this one looks good this also looks good. Then there's a bottle image with the waves behind in the ocean. And then there is a car. So I did talk about uh, the share on social media before. They have a uh, social media publisher inside of their uh, app. And uh, currently it's only integrated with uh, Twitter and you cannot uh, publish it on any other social media platform. Uh, although you can use something like Nolink or Radar or some other software on uh, AppSumo or PitchGround and you can take that and you can uh, like download the images from here and you can schedule it there. Uh, but let's look at this. Uh, let's go to share AI images and here we have uh, Twitter only integration. I did connect my Twitter here and then I can add another card and I can use the image that we just generated. So I can use it from the gallery. And I can schedule the post uh, on a date in future. Uh, target platforms is only Twitter. So they may come up with more platforms in future, but so far it's just Twitter. You can add a caption here. And you can use something like Chat GPT to give you some uh, good captions. And you can have their uh, the hashtags from it. And you can put it here and you can like uh, schedule the post. And this is for the social scheduler. So that's all for today for this review of artsmart.ai. And I think I've shared all the features it has. Some of the features like hyper-realistic was not available due to maintenance and outpainting is coming soon. So yeah, and uh, don't forget to get your deal, lifetime deal from uh, the AppSumo page, which I said before. Uh, you can get it for one code with $39 and there's a 60 day money back guarantee so you don't have to worry about it and you can like if you don't like it you can get a refund from AppSumo and uh, yeah if you purchase it uh, there's a link in the description if you purchase it from there it will really help me out. Hope you like this review of artsmart.ai and uh, don't forget to like share this video and comment down below if you have any suggestions for me 
And if you have any future softwares that you would like me to review, you can say there and subscribe for more videos like these. And bye for now.